the entire Florida Supreme Court of the judges who wouldn't hear the case against their brethren from the Florida Bar, which is oversight by the Florida Supreme Court. I mean, this is so disgusting that the lawyers are regulating the lawyers who are regulating the judges, and then the judges are regulating the judges. And if you believe in self-regulation, it's certainly against everything American. I mean, you know, these guys should be, as I said to the Senate Judiciary Committee in New York, all these bars should be abolished. All these attorney regulation committees should be abolished. It should be turned over to criminal investigators. The crimes against attorneys shouldn't be investigated by attorneys, but instead divorced people who got screwed by attorneys might be the best people to have regulate attorneys. And take it out back to felony crimes. And, you know, these are violations of the public trust, where they're using their titles to gain trust with the people. And if you're caught violating that, I think it should be triple penalties for that. And, you know, that would start setting precedents on the bars and whatnot. But anyways, all of these bars, Virginia, New York, the disciplinary departments, all the judges within that framework who are guilty of sabotaging the complaints or destroying documents or any of those things are all being sued. Including I'm suing 10 law, you know, law firms, large law firms, as I said, and there's thousands of lawyers. And I'm just one pro se guy against all those people. But they've all done a lot of wrong and they're afraid again to go into court. But the important part here, Dick, is that Christine Anderson paves the way for an understanding by the people that something needs to be done or else there is going to be an endless amount of victims to these crimes because nobody's there to stop it. The people who shoot the backstops for all this, the highest offices of law, the highest posts in the court are part of the corruption. And so that has to be broken down. Those people have to go. Most of them should go to prison and there's nothing wrong with trying them and convicting them. And, you know, nobody's titled in America above the law. And that's what we're asking for. Thank you. Thank you, counsel. We'll take the matter under advisement.